They don't work for every spot. I can see that there's something happening underneath the sticker. You can place it on a spot even before a white head comes up. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really well. In today's video, we are gonna be doing a little experiment. An experiment involving two very popular acne fighting methods. One being a drying lotion and the other being spot stickers. And I'm gonna be testing out which one is better at getting rid of a white head quicker, which one is good at getting rid of the redness, generally what the area looks like, and also, also how it contributes to that horrible nasty red mark that is left on your skin after you get a blemish. So the brand that I decided to use was purely down to the fact that they sold both a drying lotion and a spot sticker. So I went with the brand Bye Bye Blemish. It's a brand that I've known about but not really used. So I used their drying lotion. So this is pink one. They do have other drying lotions. They have quite a wide selection actually. And then obviously the spot stickers as well. So this is their microneedling blemish patches. So looking at the patches, these actually contain a serum dissolving micro tip, which honestly is so sciencey. As you can see, I've already used pretty much all of these. I just have two left. These are designed to control oil and balance the skin. They're also infused with salicylic acid, hyaluronic acid and tea tree. Tea tree is obviously also a anti-inflammatory, so it's going to help if the spot in particular is sort of raised and inflamed. And then of course you've got the salicylic acid which just gets to work at getting rid of that blemish. But also the bonus with the patches is the fact that you are covering the actual blemish. So if you are a picker or if you just get irritated by things or you're, if it's constantly rubbing on things or anything like that, it actually covers it. So you're not touching it. And if you are touching it, then you're touching the sticker, not the actual spot, which is great. So the cons for the spot stickers that I can think of is the fact that they don't work for every spot. More of the superficial spot. And they only seem to be beneficial when the acne already has its white head. And also, if you have acne in this area or you'll see in the clips right bunched up to the nose. I feel like the spot stickers, they're good, but then as soon as you start talking or eating, or even if you're putting it on straight away before bed, I usually find that they come away from the skin. Whereas if it's on a different part of your face, so a flat a surface, then it's, it's best talking about the drying lotion. So this particular product contains zinc, which is absolutely amazing for getting rid of excess oil. It's also an anti-inflammatory for the inflamed spots, but it also contains sulfur, which is also another ingredient, which is great for those, you know, those red sore inflamed blemishes as well. And again, this product also contains salicylic acid. So it's great for clearing any blocked pores, removing any sort of like impurities and just leaving your skin looking radiant. And the benefit of this product is the fact that you can put it on any blemish absolutely everywhere. And you know, unlike spot stickers it's not going to start peeling away if it's in an awkward place and also you can place it on a spot even before a white head comes up so again another bonus the only con that i can think of for drying lotions in particular is that well it's a drying lotion so it dries out your skin. So let's actually put them both to the test now a quick disclaimer before we get into the clips my skin is not the greatest, okay? I am not the sort of person that is just blessed with one spot, okay? I have pigmentation on my cheeks, on my chin. I do have hormonal acne everywhere. You know, I only gave birth four months ago, so 
yes my hormones are still all over the place so within this video you will see other blemishes and you will see my pigmentation however i do clearly point out exactly what blemish i'm looking at and i've also taken pictures as well so you can definitely see differences between the before image and the after image as well it is tuesday the 22nd of march and I guess today is day zero, so the two spots that I'm going to be focusing on is this massive one here and then this one here. I'm going to do the drying lotion on this one and the spot sticker on this one. So I'm just going to place this on here. Be interesting to know how quickly the redness and that dies down as well. I'm just gonna take, I hope I'm placing this in the right place. It is Wednesday the 23rd of March, so the next morning. I can see that there's something happening underneath the sticker and with the drying lotion, this is completely dried, but I can still see a white head. It is later on that day, it is still the 23rd of March. I feel like this one is dead, but there's still a slight white head. I should have done this yesterday, but I think I'm going to apply two spot stickers. So one on this one, which is the one that we originally were going to do, but I think I'm going to put one there as well, just because it's right next to it, just to see what happens. Happens. But yeah, I feel like one application hasn't really done that. Good morning, you guys. It is the next day. So I've just taken everything off, washed my face. So here is what my spots are looking here. I feel like both white heads have gone, I believe. Here is what this is looking like. And again, the white head has gone the red mark is obviously still there so there you have it there's the clips that is using both the spot sticker and the drying lotion on my blemishes After reviewing those clips and the pictures i do have to say that i'm slightly disappointed in them both it may just be the brand it may just be the particular products i know that there are a lot of amazing um drying lotions out there and i know that there are a lot of amazing spot stickers out there but the reason why i'm slightly disappointed is mainly down to the fact that it that both of them both took two days for the whitehead to disappear i've used other products before the same methods and it only took a day so that is what i'm going off with the drying lotion in particular i thought with the ingredients that would help reduce the redness and i found that with the drying lotion it did not do that so i did take pictures afterwards and the redness did go down eventually so whether or not it was just it was just me being too quick in expecting the redness but i just generally thought it would sort of relieve a little bit anyway the biggest thing that i've noticed was the fact that usually i get a red mark after every blemish doesn't matter how big how small whether it's superficial whether it's under the skin doesn't matter i always end up with a red mark but with using the drying lotion and this spot in particular the one that was next to my nose i have not gotten a red mark so i am very impressed with that one with the spot stickers although the the blemishes on this side was not as inflamed as the one that was next to my nose it still had redness but it had that stubborn redness you know the kind of redness that lasts for months like i said again with this one it took two days for the whitehead to go away so definitely disappointed in that but overall again the stickers were really really easy to apply really really easy to take off i did notice when i put them on although they're like serum infused micro darts that sort of like dissolve i did sort of feel like a prickling sensation when i applied it but other than that it was completely fine because it was on a flat area the sticker sort of like stayed on my skin so looking at both products although i had issues with each of them looking at the actual general method so the drying lotion spot stickers i actually really love both 
and I think it comes down to what type of acne you have. If I were looking at this particular brand, I would pick the drying lotion over the spot sticker. However, generalizing the methods, I really like them both, and like I said, it depends on what type of acne you have. It's more superficial, more on the surface, whitehead spot stickers. If it's more like deep, cystic under the skin then drying lotion would be really really good because you can put that on even before the whitehead has come up so yeah that's basically my little experiment i call it an experiment it's not as if i'm a scientist but yeah i hope you really enjoyed this video let me know down in the comments what your favorite method is i know that there are a lot more acne fighting methods out there i just wanted to pick two and see what which one was best give this video a thumbs up if you liked it if you don't already and you've been loving my videos i would absolutely love for you to subscribe and join the family i have a lot more videos on acne blemishes in general and testing out different products but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.